V8 Bayliner 94. So in the world of Bayliners, relatively new. I'm just gonna point out things I noticed as I walk along. On the other side of the bow, there's a big gash. Um, that does have one of these life rafts. Uh, obviously probably needs to be repacked, which costs thousands. Uh, missing panel of, uh, oops, missing panel on there for the uh, <coughs> flying bridge. Definitely needs pressure washed. Um, bright work's not done. Beautiful part about this boat is it has the ex transom extension, which is great. It has this la uh, latches for a davit for the boat. Beautiful uh, storage area in that um, transom extension. Nice patch. Um, oops, let me just. Sorry about that. Anyway, walk through that is nice. All looks clean here. Um, I'll pull up this. Yeah, your gen set is Westerbeak, it looks like. Access to your engine. End room looks fairly clean, but the Westerbeak definitely needs some love. Builders look clean. Um, this boat just needs, it needs somebody to take care of it. This guy is, oh shit, Jesus, this guy is not taking care of this boat. The longer it stays in hand, his hand, the worse it's going to get. Walking through, the carpet is trash. The upholstery on the, uh, looks okay. I don't notice a lot of uh, much leaking leaks. Here's your uh, galley down. It's of course trashed. Missing flooring uh, right here. Um, stateroom, you know, decent sized stateroom. These 38s, you can see mold up in here. A lot of mold they're gonna need taken care of. Condensation leak. Not really that wet here. A lot of mold throughout. Mold on the doors. And this is a shared. This boat could be brought back to life. Here's a secondary access. There's, but you can see all the mold on the door. Mold on the base. Teaks are not in bad shape. I don't know where the light is here. I don't think the light's working here. Anyway. And then there's a stateroom master suite bathroom, which is pretty nice and decent shape. Um, anyway, coming back out, I don't know if the Norco works. Once again, it needs cleaned. I think this white carpet needs replaced. All the electronics are 90s versions, probably need to be updated. Um, everything else looks fairly reasonable here on a quirk first glance. Nice built-in stereo. Oh. Engine room, he's a, he, he, this I guess is the wrapped around uh, uh, plastic for the cockpit area here. So, and then going into the engine room, you know, they moved it over here. So it actually looks fairly decent. It's not trashed. Everything looks fairly clean. Um, it needs maintenance. This is a good. Uh, anyway, uh, going up on the flybridge, it's of course a shit show. You know, it needs. It has the one nice thing is it a hard, hard top. Of course, mold everywhere. I do like the covered cockpit. So. Anyway, oh, Jesus. The sooner this boat is put into somebody's hands that can care for it, the better, because it's going to go downhill fast. Uh, anyway, that's a quick walkthrough of the Tranquility Base.